of our kids in those swim classes. Yeah. That, that, something like that. I, 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 I took him as a kid. Um, yeah. I don't know where I went awry. I could not swim a lane. I could not stay in my <laughs> lane in a pool to save my soul. So your problem was you couldn't stay in your lane? I could not <laughs> stay in my lane, which may be good in some circumstances. Right, you know, yeah. freestyle out in the <laughs> lake somewhere, I got this. Ani's, Ani's <laughs> way over. over. I'm sorry, I'm in your back. Life. You just meander a bit. <laughs> yeah, I, I yeah. like to meet and greet yeah. in, in a pool. <laughs> <laughs> but I could stay afloat. No. Hey, you could. You were not drowning. You no. know, David, we're, no. we're not, David said we're not too far away from the pool weather. It'll almost feel like it today with some spots approaching 80. But we're going to have some cloud cover today. You can see some of those clouds from our uh, Coleman Regional Medical Center camera. Temperatures sitting in the 60s to start the day. Except for Coleman, you're down to 59. Everybody else above the 60 degree mark. Some cloud cover across the state of Alabama. A few spots seeing some light showers too. Not all of what you're seeing on the radar here making it down to the ground, but a few sprinkles mainly west and northwest of Birmingham to start the day. Uh, we may see a couple of spots with some light rain, but measurable rain not really in the cards when they is stuff this morning. The winds are going to be the bigger story today, and those continue to trend up. Wind advisory for north and central Alabama, and we could see some wind gusts strong enough that some tree limbs could be issue an issue. Some loose items could get blown around, and I can't even rule out a couple of power outages as we head through the next 36 hours. Those gusts climbing above 30 miles an hour as we head into this afternoon and this evening. And with all the gusty winds building in and all the smoky, fiery weather we've been dealing with over the past few days, that's going to be a question too. We do have some wildfire smoke uh, still across uh, the state of Alabama still uh, around in the atmosphere this morning. And as we look at conditions for fire weather, we've got the humidity values on here and the wind gusts. As we head into the afternoon, those relative humidity values do dip some. This is not quite to red flag criteria or fire weather warning criteria, but I would not do any burning today with those wind gusts climbing about 30 miles an hour. And again, relatively dry air in place as we head into this afternoon. Temperatures today topping up in the upper 70s will drop down into the 60s as we head into tonight. We've got that chance for rain on the way tomorrow, but most of today looking dry. Here comes a cold front on Wednesday, though. That brings us a few showers. Note the temperatures here at 10 a.m. Close to 70 around Birmingham, down into the 50s across North Alabama. So some colder air building in as we head into Wednesday afternoon. Those temperatures will be dipping. Wednesday will stay in the 50s, Thursday and Friday. Rain returning Friday, often on sprinkles this weekend, and then another round of rain and storms as we head into Monday. Chris